Good day everyone, you're watching Radio Fixes. On this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix in case if you're not able to use snipping tool on your Windows machine. Now, there are a couple of st steps you need to try in order to fix a problem. Without any delay, let's get started. Now, just to give you a heads up, now the steps what I'm going to perform here are applicable for all the versions of Windows. It's Currently, I'm using Windows 11. In case if you want to try these steps for the previous version, uh, you can also go ahead and try this step. Now, the first step, what I would suggest you to do is to go ahead and uh, reset, repair uh, the snipping tool from your Windows 11 machine. To do that, what you will have to do is you will have to click on the Start button. Click on the Settings. Once you are on the Settings, you will have to... Once you are on the Settings, you will have to click on um, Apps from the left-hand side. Under Apps, you will have to click on Apps and Features. Now this will show you the list of applications or apps which are already installed on the machine. Uh, so you will have to scroll down a bit. You can go with the alphabetical order. So look for snipping tool, which will be right under this section. Click on the three dotted lines. Click on advanced option. Once you're on the advanced option, uh, what you will have to do is you will have to click on reset. Once you click on reset, it will go ahead and reset the app on your uh, Windows. Now, after trying a reset, uh, you can close this window and then try to launch snipping tool and see if that works. In case if it works, well and good, you don't have to try the next step. Now, the next step, you will have to uh, follow the same settings. You will have to click on the start button, go to settings. Once you're on the settings page, go back to apps. Under apps, go to apps and features. Like I did uh, previously, you can scroll down a bit on this section till you find snipping tools under this section. Once you're scrolled down a bit, click on the three dotted lines under snipping tool. Go to advanced option. Scroll down on, scroll down on this window and um, try to repair. So basically what you're trying to do is you're trying to repair the Windows snipping tool app on your Windows machine. Once the repair is complete, um, you can try to launch snipping tool and see if that works. In case if it works, well and good, you don't have to try the next step. Now in um, the next step, you follow the same options what I followed for the second step and come back to the apps and features settings. Click on the three dotted lines and this will take you to the same window. Under this section which says, let this app run in the background, make sure it has been al always, uh, it's been set as always. So make sure don't set as never. Always make sure it has been set as always or power optimize recommended. So this is the settings what I would choose. So always make sure this is this settings has been changed from never to always or power optimize and uh, close this window and try to launch your Try to launch your Windows snipping tool and see if that works. In case if it works, well and good, you don't have to try the next step. Now, uh, in spite of trying all these steps, if you're still facing a problem with your Windows snipping tool, the next option, what I would suggest you to try is to run the um, store app troubleshooter. Now, to do this, what you will have to do is you will have to click on the start button again, click on settings. Once you're on the settings page, you will have to scroll down a bit and click on troubleshoot. Under troubleshoot, click on other troubleshooters. Under this section, uh, you will see an option or you will see an option which says Windows Store App. This is the troubleshooter for Windows Store App. Click on run. So basically what this will do is it will try to run the troubleshooter and for Windows App Store because this is the app from the uh, store and try to fix the problem by itself in case if uh, there is a problem. It would try to go ahead and repair by itself and uh, once the repair is complete, what you can do is you can try to launch the uh, Windows snipping tool and see if that works. In case um, if, it, if it works well and good, uh, you don't have to try the next step. So uh, what you will have to do is you will have to click on next. Uh, it will try to detect the any of the additional problems. Um, basically, in my case, um, it should not throw any error message. However, um, the hanging or crashing apps has not been fixed. Now, this is something which I didn't face any problem. So you can just ignore this. Uh, click on next. 
click on close and uh, try to launch Windows snipping tool and see if it works. Now, in spite of trying all this step, if you're not able to launch Windows app, uh, Windows snipping tool, the next step, what I would suggest you to try is to install the Windows update. How do you check if you have any latest updates for your Windows? You click on the start button, click on settings. Once you're on the settings page, on the left hand side, click on Windows update. Now here, uh, check if you have any latest update. So you, you go ahead and install, click on install now. Once the updates has been installed, restart your computer and uh, restart your computer and um, check if you are able to launch Windows app a snipping tool on your computer. So this is one step which you can try. Now, in spite of trying all these steps, if you're still not able to fix any problem, uh, fix the Windows snipping tool uh, problem on your computer. So in spite of trying all this step, if you're still not able to, uh, uh, if this issue has been not resolved, the next step, what I would suggest you to do is to run the SFC scan on your Windows machine. Now, basically, what this will do is this will go ahead and try to fix if there is any issues with any of the dll files dll files are nothing but the dynamic link library files so how do you run the sfc scan you will have to open the run command in the ad admin mode so in the search box you can go ahead and type cmd click on run as administrator you will have to open the command prompt as an administrator in case if you get user access control prompt, you may click on yes or continue on the screen. Now on from this command, you will have to go ahead and type SFC space forward slash scan now. So as soon as you hit enter, there are a couple of stages um, where the SFC scan would try to run by itself. And under each phases, it will um, you will have to, once it has been completed, you will have to go ahead and restart the computer. And once your computer restarts, try to launch Windows snipping tool, and uh, that should eventually work. So these are the steps what you can try to fix in case if you're not able to launch a Windows snipping tool. Um, I hope this video was useful. In case if you like this video, please make sure to hit the like button and do not forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a great day.